Hello everyone, this is going to be a quick video tutorial about a few little tricks you can do to increase your damage output with various weapons. So the first thing is the Hagbane finger roll. So the Hagbane arrow has a impact damage, uh, a dot, and there's a radius uh, with which that's applied. And the impact damage and the radius is larger on the charge attack than the light attack. Uh, but you don't need to charge the arrow back all the way to get that radius and damage. So this is if you hold right click, but if you do the finger roll, you just release right click like this. You can do the charge attacks, like mini charge attacks, much quicker. And you will still apply the maximum impact damage and radius. Similar thing with conflag, if you hold right click, this is as fast as you can draw. But if you release right click, you can draw patches much, much quicker. And I believe that is the maximum hypothetical damage output. That was my outlook. Uh, versus ogres is mini patches at the feet. Somebody can correct me if I'm wrong. The next thing I wanted to show is the uh, falchion chain cancel. So you can see uh, it's unique in that its block animation is instantaneous. Every other weapon in the game does that. So you go attack, attack, block. Everybody knows that, right? But with falchion, we can abuse that quirk with the blocking and all you do is you left click and right click simultaneously on every other attack and you can also do this on single attacks that's much quicker than traditional block canceling the next thing i wanted to show is active reload so all you do is you simply tap r once after firing you can just spam r but uh you really only need to press it once so it's like did that did that did that I'm pretty sure that works for, like, every weapon in the game. Again, I'm sure somebody will correct me if I'm wrong. The next thing that I wanted to show is what I call QQ Cancel. So this applies to the two-handed hammer for soldier and the uh, raid axe for dwarf. All you do, light attack, QQ, light attack. And as with the falchion chain cancel, this is significantly quicker than traditional block cancel. So you can go play whack-a-mole. And something a little bit more fundamental, just in case people don't know it. Uh, same concept as not charging your attacks up all the way with Hagbane. You don't need to do that with any melee weapon in the game. The, like, charging longer, that doesn't do more damage than this does. So you just release your charge attack early. If you do it too quickly, you'll do a light attack like that. And you can figure out the, the timing that way. And see, if you do it too quickly, you do light attacks. Alright, that's about everything I can think of. Hopefully it was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions, and take care.